Clayton? Yo. We're gonna do it live. We'll do it live! Fuck it! Do it live! I can, I'll write it and we'll do it live! And thing sucks! Live. live, we're live. We decided we're gonna put the hoopty on the dyno. Yeah, let's tell the people we actually just spent the last four hours trying to figure out how to do it live with multiple cameras. Yes. And, yeah. We totally have no idea how to do that. Well, we do now. Uh, but this will be our first live session that we're gonna do. We'll tell you about the time specifically towards the end of the video. It's coming up very soon though. Um, we're gonna try to make 600 wheel horsepower with this thing. We're very close. It's made 566 for those who followed it along. But we're gonna pu push it until basically it breaks. So. Or we run out of time. Or we run out of time. Okay, so some people have suggested we, you know, change out some of the hardware on it to see if we can make some more horsepower by maybe doing a different throttle body or a different intake manifold or we've had plenty of people say put rods in it. We know what it takes to make decent power with these 180s and I have zero interest in doing any modifications to this thing aside from what we've done to this point. The reason is, is we were testing what we could make on a stock engine. We're not looking to do any more upgrades. We're just going to push it until it's dead. And that's basically it. And so it's garbage. What? And it's garbage, garbage, yes. But we're not going to do any modifications, anything. What you guys have seen in this video series, that's what we're going to do. And that's what we're going to try to make more horsepower on. A few people also have mentioned trying to bring it to the drag strip and racing it. Uh, for one, this is a terrible idea in this car. <laughs> but two, it is winter here. So to keep, this won't last to the point of it being able to go to the track. It's no, going to be- There's parts on it we need for other cars. Yeah, that too. Um, but the main, main reason, even if this was summertime and we were doing this same thing, the stock O2J transmission in these cars is not up to the task or the axles for drag racing at this kind of power level in this heavy of a car. Yes, just like my drag car transmission, we can, which is over there, that's an O2J transmission. Oh, that's attached. Yeah, um, with yeah the they can handle a lot of power with lots of modifications to them. A stock transmission like this, it's not gonna hold. I literally would launch the car. I mean, I might be able to slip the clutch really far, but there's not gonna be any record breaking quarter mile times with this car and a stock transmission most likely the transmission would be left on the ground at the starting line what? right <laughs> speaking of things breaking talking about the transmission if we try to drag race it i'm at the point now where i'm going to just touch on a few things of what is likely going to fail in it so a couple of things for sure are going to be the first to fail or most likely to fail one is going to be we bend or break a rod, which is going to be pretty common. Two is going to be the rod bolt itself failing. Oh, yeah. Another thing that's potential to fail, it's not really so much horsepower related. They kind of just, you know, leave the chat when they want is the exhaust valve. That could literally happen at any time we drop a valve and that'll destroy it for sure. Forget about that one. And the one that most people, you know, you may have not have thought of this. I'm to the point now with boost that we're potentially going to compromise the head gasket. I mentioned that. You did? Yeah. So stock head bolts, stock gasket, um, which the gaskets are fine usually. It's just the clamping force between the head and the block. Using stock head, or head bolts, um, we're already at 40 pounds of boost. We have another three or four pounds of boost to go on the map sensor on the ECU safely. So that's a potential. We could just torch a head gasket and we don't even get to break it. I hope that's not the case. I hope we get to the point where we've exceeded the limits of the connecting rods is where I'm really <laughs> hoping. Um, torching a head gasket isn't gonna be fun. It's not gonna be very exciting. Okay, next. Some other things to talk about. I'm making a bunch of you like that, Clayton? Is yeah, that good for the video good. editing? Yeah, love it, love it. Um, a couple of things other also I want to mention, you know, most people are over this engine. Guys are moved on to many different platforms and different engines. We just picked this up to have some fun with. Um, what we're doing is not 
Rocket appliances, is that what they say? Was that right. what uh, right. Ricky. Ricky says? Um, we're just, again, having some fun with this thing and trying to push it a little bit further. Plenty of guys have made good horsepower with these in the past. Maybe we've made the most. I think so. We have. I think we have at this point. But, again, we're not doing anything magical here. The 1AT has been around for 25 years, something like that. And... Although I obviously have a pretty decent handle of the tuning of this thing, there's a lot better tuners out there than I am. Again, we're just having some fun with it and trying to see what we can do. Clay, we're gonna wrap this up, almost. A couple more things to talk about. One, we're looking for a graphic designer of sort. We have some ideas for potentially some stickers. Um, Clayton and I both have a really keen eye when it comes to doing graphic design and stuff like that, but we simply don't have the time. So if you have the skill set with the ability or know somebody that's willing to help out. We're not looking for stuff for free. We're just looking for specifically more a car related person that may be interested in helping us out with some designs. Clayton, am I right by saying that? Did I clarify what I was Damn right. trying to get to? Yeah, and obviously your taste is good, so. <laughs> I mean, this, <laughs> you couldn't say anything more than what this is and what it's become. And the patrons, we can't thank you guys enough. All the patrons that have jumped on board uh, to help us out. We really, really appreciate it. And um, it's going to help us do more projects like this. We do have a couple ideas for the next one. Uh, we're not going to bring it up yet because clearly this one's still living. But we are planning on doing a couple more similar kind of turbo setups and uh, see what we can push out of them. Yeah, so if you like this type of content and well, maybe not this exact car, but stuff like this, the patrons definitely help. Definitely helps out. And then last, when are we going to do this, Clayton? When are we going to get this thing back on the rollers and... Blow it up finally? Try for 600. I want to try to really make 600 wheel horsepower now. Live. 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 Um, and probably blow it up on the dyno. So we're going to do it on March the 12th. Right? Yes. One, Saturday, two. March the 12th. This Saturday, 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 Saturday. March the 12th at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. We're going to go live with this thing. We have a good, please be patient with us also when we do this live, but I think we have a pretty good handle on what we need to do to make this happen. Yeah, we're going to have the chat open window for everybody, so keep, yep. it, uh, keep it safe. Yep, and exactly. And uh for those local to us that are following this along we are on atlantic time not eastern standard time so keep that in mind but we are filming and starting live at 6 p.m eastern standard time on what day march the 12th Saturday, 6 p.m march the 12th right got it everybody got it clayton am i forgetting anything i don't know it's uh it's gonna be exciting blow this thing up make it happen yeah it's if we can make 600 with it i know we're close I, I mean, most people can tell in the last video that I was pretty bewildered about the whole thing. Like, I really didn't think it could make that kind of power. Um, but we're going to try for a little bit more, see what we can make. So, if you have any questions or comments, be sure to ask them below. And we'll see you next Saturday. Live. Live. Bye! Saturday, 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 Saturday.